Big scare for George H.W. Bush. Aides say he is in stable condition, but spent the night at a hospital in Portland, Maine, and is still there this morning. He took a fall yesterday while at their family home in Kennebunkport, breaking a vertebrae in his neck. Now, his spokesman tweeting overnight, quote, his condition is stable, he is fine, but he will be in a neck brace. Now, over the years, we have seen many photos of the former president skydiving, jumping out of hel helicopters, most recently just last year on his 90th birthday. But Bush is the oldest living former U.S. president, and he has battled with his health, health in the past. Last year, he was hospitalized for shortness of breath. In 2012, he was in the hospital for two months for a bronchitis-related cough, and he does have Parkinson's disease and is wheelchair-bound. Now, just last week, Bush did make an appearance at many events in Maine with hundreds of donors to his son Jeb Bush's presidential campaign. But he did miss his son's big campaign announcement when he declared he was running for president in June. His wife attended that announcement without him.